Well, how much different is it than this time last year, as far as you know, starting and everything? A lot, uh, it's a lot different. I feel more um, comfortable being a, a left tackle now with a right tackle, and just I feel a lot smarter. Just the game slows down since I've been in my playbook, been like knowing just the philosophy of the of the game. How did the O line grade in the scrimmage the other day? Pretty good. Uh, I think yeah, I think it was pretty good across the board. Most things were just decision areas, uh, errors, stuff. Uh, could have made a better decision here. Uh, not very many, many errors. What were the pluses and the and the minuses from it? Uh, pluses is very good. Pass pro wise, we've been very good pass pro. Uh, minuses, I think we got to start faster. Uh, we've been. Focusing on finishing strong, finishing strong. We can't get away from starting, starting strong too. What have y'all worked on most the uh, last couple of days since the scrimmage? Since the scrimmage, we've come, uh, mainly working on running the ball more. Like I said, we've been uh, very focused on uh, pass pro and stuff since uh, last year and stuff. So we can't get away from what we do here at Arkansas, which is run the ball. So we're just working on. Uh, being a balance of both. How are you more comfortable at left than right? Because usually you think of left as a tougher position mm-hmm. trying to protect the quarterback blind side. Oh, well, I've been playing left tackle since I was in sixth grade, so it's just comfortable for me. Uh, it is more of my strong suit. How much did you learn about yourself last year and some of the adversity you went through? A lot. Uh, a lot of just being... Uh, mainly just mental toughness, just going through stuff like that, um, not giving up, just pushing forward, making it, make it turning a negative into a positive, and just being mental tough. What kind of cohesive, cohesiveness do you five have up there with getting the experience you guys got last year? A lot. Um, I'm the only one that didn't start the whole year last year. Um, but other than that, we're we're tight. We're hang out uh, on and off the field. Uh, really close. Um, we go out uh, together, but once on the field, it's business. What kind of growth have you seen in, in Froholt there beside you? A lot. He's more more vocal, more he, – he plays more with more confidence than um, he did last year. He's more taking more of the, the leader role. Have you gotten equal doses going up against uh, Sosa and also T.J. Smith and Armand, kind of a good mix of all those guys? Yeah. What about what have you seen from Sosa this year? Sosa, I've seen a lot from Sosa. He's more uh, – he kind of acts like uh, kind of like the hype man for the defense. He gets the, the defense going, uh, gets them all riled up and all that stuff, along with uh, T.J. Smith, I, I've noticed a lot of change in T.J. Smith since last year. He's a lot more powerful, a lot more vocal. Um, he play, he's playing a lot better. Coach Anderson on Saturday said there's seven to eight guys he can count on there um, with you five and then two to three behind you guys. How do you see the depth kind of building there uh, on the, the second string? Yeah, it, it, it's coming along. It's just guys got to realize that just like in my position last year, uh, you're just a snap away from being in the game. It's just because just, just you're a freshman or a sophomore doesn't mean you have time to wait and sit around. It's just you got to be ready to go. Big a positive, sorry, How big a positive was Saturday not getting Austin hit and just kind of maybe improving on that pass block? Good. Uh, it was real good. Well, we're real prideful about that. Um, we have this system set up where it involves like sacks and drops and QB hits and miss assignments. It's all the 12% rule, and we just got to stick to that 12 being uh, under 12% in those mental errors. You look back on last year, you think really they asked probably too much of you and you to be as inexperienced as were to be starting and everything as an SEC offensive lineman. You said what? Well, do you think they almost asked too much of y'all? I mean, to have the, the little experience that you did to be shoved in there as starters. Uh, last year. I'm I'm not going to put any blame on anybody but myself because I could. I've, like I said, you have to be ready on this snap away, and also I wasn't ready at the time. But uh, uh, I think overall, uh, I could have done a better job. What's the main difference you feel this year? Just the experience? Or? Yeah, experience, knowledge, and uh, strength. A lot stronger than last year. Mm-hmm.